Tony, you want to meet a friend of mine? Sure. Whoa. <laughs> Cute one. Yeah. Who's this here? This your? <laughs> Let me show you something. <laughs> you know what this is? It's a real tarantula. Skin. Oh. Yeah, I don't know much about it, but our next guest does. Everybody, would you please welcome our preacher keeper, Warren Eckstein. <laughs> Uh, I, would, uh, I would shake your hand, but tell me about this. Isn't this interesting? This is actually spiders like snakes will shed, and they shed everything, including their fangs. Those are the fangs right there. And uh, the interesting part is this spider right here is what this came from just a couple of days ago. So that's the, act, the, exact, the actual spider. So this was part of that spider not that long ago. No idea. My goodness. Now, Warren, bugs have a pretty bad rap. Do yeah. they serve any good purpose? You know, no one likes bugs. No one has a good word to say about bugs or spiders, but every animal on this planet has a good purpose. For example, spiders eat certain insects, which would be harmful. Insects eat certain plants that would be harmful. So everything really does balance itself out in the long run. What are they doing? I mean, you know, yeah, these look funny. Things. I noticed yeah. you all standing in the back, Tony. Yeah, right. <laughs> 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 the, the thing to remember is that some are dangerous and some aren't. Let me give you an example. Here we have some scorpions. Everyone's afraid of scorpions. Ooh, wow. These are big scorpions. Fred, if you would just stick your hand in here, Fred. Wait on, a minute. Fred, Fred, please. Give me a minute. Why don't we go way back? Wait, wait, wait. Trust me, Fred. Trust me. I can pick one of these up? Sure you can. Wait a minute. Oh. Okay. There you go. Just like that. There you go. Just like that. There you go. There you go. Oh, okay. Okay. Put it back down. Now that is, I mean, he doesn't want to go back down. Warren, oh. Warren. Oh. Ah, wait, go. That's an emperor. That's an, uh, an emperor scorpion. Now that isn't dangerous, Tony, but you ask me about danger. And over here, we have something called a death stalker scorpion. Now, this, that little guy? This, this little scorpion here is from Egypt, ancient Israel, and it's very, very deadly. And one of the things that's interesting about scorpions, the smaller the claws, the smaller the stinger, the more deadly the scorpion is. So this little guy is deadly, that big guy, no problem whatsoever. Yeah, you like think it's the opposite. You would yeah. think, but it's totally different that way. And tarantulas also are kind of interesting animals. A lot of people think tarantulas are deadly, <laughs> deadly animals, and they're not really deadly. This tarantula, for example, is a Chilean rose uh, tarantula, Ooh. and uh, if it were to sting you, which is pretty rare because these are pretty mellow, uh, it's no worse than a bee sting or a wasp sting, and a lot of people do keep them as pets. Yet, there are other types of spiders that I would really not recommend uh, too much at all. Let me uh, give you an example. Here we have what's called a baboon spider. And uh, this guy, a baboon spider, and he, uh, you're going to see that he is not the uh, friendliest guy. You're going to see him here that he's not the friendliest guy in the world. So we're going to talk to him. See, oh, there he goes. Whoa. He's up on his hind legs. And you see those those black things that I'm pointing to? Yeah. Those are the actual fangs where the, the venom would come from. So this one is not, again, the type that I would recommend. Yeah, I don't know what it means in <laughs> but he's definitely saying, leave me alone, yeah, Lauren, yeah, quickly. So again, that's the one you wouldn't want to have as a pet. Now, what about cockroaches? They seem like they're everywhere, and we can't get rid of them. Cockroaches have been around for millions of years, and I'm a firm believer that when the world ends, cockroaches will be around even then. Here I just happen to have some cockroaches with me. Ooh. And, uh, oh, ooh. Those are, those those are, these are puppies. Are, now, these, are, these are not your average. These are Madagascar hissing cockroaches. That's what we have today. And we have our little bugs on the little microphone. Because they do make some noise. If, uh, if we can get them to make some noise, uh, they will, but they're not going to. You see how even cockroaches aren't that ugly, are they? Huh? Yeah. Yeah. I guess yeah, okay. yeah, what, a, what good are cockroaches? Right? Cockroaches are kind of interesting because now they're using cockroaches to predict earthquakes. They put them in colonies and they react when there's going to be an earthquake. And when people see them react, they know there's a problem. Maybe that's the reason they've been around for so many millions of years is based on the fact that they can predict things like that. Wow. So what about the, I see these, uh, yeah. what is that thing? Ah, on? these are Asian yeah. millipedes. Ooh. And a lot of people yeah. think, uh, Millipedes have a thousand legs, and the way it works is that they have two legs per segment body, and they can have up to 230, 300 different mm -hmm. legs, but they don't actually have a thousand legs. And these are kind of nice. They don't bite or anything. They, they don't yeah. hurt you. No, as a matter of fact, Lindsay, can I borrow your shoulder? Oh, 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 there, you go. Here. there you go. Don't move. Don't move. Stay. There you go. Isn't that great? <laughs> what interesting animal. Can, can this actually train? Can insects be trained? They really can't be trained like a dog or a cat. You're not going to walk it down the street. But if you have a tarantula and you, you handle it every day and you talk to it every day, it will get to know you. But again, it's not going to be tricked like sit up to be a floor and speak. Yeah. But they can be. Uh, they and they, can but be you, some of these do make respect, re respectable pets. I yeah, you know they do. But the thing that you have to remember is you want to educate yourself first. In other words, if you're going to get a tarantula, make sure you know what you're doing. If you're going to get any of these animals, they can make good pets. But really study them first. And uh, they really, some people really become interested. Well, they are That's fascinating kind of animals. Idea. But next time, you know, it's always great to have you here. Yeah. Next time, how about cats, dogs, puppies, kittens, yeah. something like that, yeah. you know? Yeah.
Warren. Lindsay, Thank I've you. never seen you so still. Yeah, this is yours. Your jewelry. Thank you very much. Warren X on a big round of applause. Thank you.